How's everybody doing? My name is Mike from Roots Canine Training. Today I want to talk a little bit about small dogs. What type of collar should you use on a small dog? Okay, so I had a slip lead I was using on uh, this dog and the other Yorkie, but what was happening is not so much with her, but the other dog, Bentley, uh, he was coughing with the uh, slip lead. It just must have been a little too thin for him. They have very small necks. So the best thing to do is use some type of wide collar on their neck so that will uh, distribute pressure evenly across their neck and not give them that, <coughs> that coughing fit. So with this girl right here, let me show you guys what we're doing. We got, if you can see this orange collar, she's got a lot of hair, but this is, this collar this collar that you guys just saw is actually uh, an e-collar collar, right? It just doesn't have the uh, electronic box on it. And uh, it works good for, the, for these smaller dogs because you can cut it to size. And the, the collar is actually, I believe it's three-quarter inch wide. So uh, what that does is uh, they have such a small neck, these Yorkies, that the size of the collar relative to their neck is fairly wide. So, uh, you know, it's almost like half the size of their neck. So that's what you want with a small dog so you can make corrections and you're not going to hurt the dog or if the dog pulls, they're not going to cough. So if your dog's like constantly coughing, that's when they could actually hurt themselves. So you want to get a collar that's going to be nice and thick and wide on your small dog so you can make corrections without hurting their smaller necks.